I slept. We're headed to Costco and Best Buy and a bunch of other errands, but I just, um, go ahead. Ashley's coming with us. I just weighed myself. I, don't, I haven't even told Jason this. And I'm the lowest I've been since I started tracking like a year ago. Oh, nice. I didn't so, know well, I was tracking at Marla's house like on Saturday night when she had a scale. And I kind of tested her scale the other night to see if it was like right along what mine is here at home still. And it was in within ounces of what my scale said. And that was after eating snacks. I think it's fairly accurate. So that's kind of promising. Good for you. It's always lower in the morning, obviously, than it is at the end of the day. So I track both measurements. Fall. I know. I'm just gonna do my seatbelt up. Oh, Ash, can you go get my water from me real quick? It's on the counter. But mm, I didn't do my walking yesterday. I took a day of rest yesterday. <laughs> we all did. We all did. I think you took two naps. I took one solid two-hour nap and then stayed on the couch the rest of the day. I was. I, didn't, I had a headache, so I didn't drink enough water. I'm gonna make sure I stay on top of my water today. Well. Costco is closed for Memorial, or what, what, what holiday are we on? Labor Day? Which is fine. I like when he comes to Costco with me because he helps me put it away. <laughs> but I'll come tomorrow. It'll be a light Costco, especially if I come alone. I don't feel so great. Just. Are we going to go home and get Chelsea? Or? No, she just wanted us to get her a notebook. She's um, doing so many art pictures and drawings and sketches that she's filled up her little notebook that she's got and she wants a new one keeping her back for school and to work on so we'll just go grab that we don't have Costco to do we'll survive like we have milk we'll get through one more day during that we just realized like we still have milk in the fridge which usually during the summer we were like could barely get to Monday morning and we didn't even have enough milk having them back in school is saving us <laughs> because we still have milk, we still have cereal, we still have all the foods, right Ash? Yeah. You're not all like devouring it all day long and even all night long because you're eating three dinners a night. <laughs> so I like having them back in school. Got a lot more than we expected here at Target. Dad's getting some displays for the you store. You went on every single aisle. You, you lost you two times. That's okay. Um, <laughs> It's okay, we're getting some stuff for Dad's store, and then, anyway, a bunch of other stuff. And Ashley's buying some moon sand, so she's putting her money in. So Ashley bought herself some new moon sand, right? Yeah. Little shimmer shake. But, what else did we buy? Boo. Uh, I bought her this little $6 tray from the kitchen section, and it's perfect. Keeps it contained. But you just did a cool thing. You like spread it all out and then can do your little cutouts and stuff. Yeah. You love this stuff, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> you it's, like it too. I do. I like that you have something to do and it's tactile and it relaxes you a lot, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It gives me something to do when I'm bored of watching. Yeah. Which is perfect. So, she's going to do that. We're not going to eat these. Dad's been eating a lot of them. He's been coming up here grabbing them. All right. Okay, can you throw these away? And then I got these two little packs. So uh, we have this little family that I sat next to during her football game because yeah. our son plays football. Um, but then we go to church with them and yesterday I could have used these in church. So I got to church with Jason yesterday. These guys were sleeping in and <laughs> this mom, this friend of mine, she texted me and she's like, go sit with my kids. My husband took my kids to church. Our cat got out, the one that we watched, our, their cat got out. And she was like, I'm trying to find her. I can't find her. So I had to go up and kind of sit with her kids because her husband had to kind of be up on the stand and not sitting with his kids. And so, so I was hanging out with the kids, but I really could have used like some kind of little art kit because she had the diaper bag. So they, did, they didn't have anything to play with and they have little kids. And so... At least like a toddler, two toddlers. Yeah, they have two toddlers. The oldest is her age. Yeah. And so, so that's nine and then probably a seven-year-old and then like a four-year-old and a two-year-old. So Your done. I'm going to keep these on hand for football games and for church if they sit by us to kind of have a little activity for them to play with because they started to eat all of my mints. <laughs> I didn't have anything else. So I was just feeding them mints at the football game and then yesterday at church. So I'm going to keep them, keep myself stocked up on this kind of stuff to be the fun person they get to sit next to. You also got 
All right, this is the last place I wanted to be today. I'm gonna be completely honest. I have cramps like I haven't had in a decade. Is he coming? All right, sorry about that. My father and I came over to give the kids Labor Day ice cream. <laughs> um, and we were showing him Ashley's little cheer dance from halftime. He's just tickled to see how good she's getting at it. But I didn't want to get on this treadmill. My cramps are seriously so bad. I haven't, normally I don't get like a stomach cramp every month. I, I just don't, I get stomach, or I get back pain because of my endometriosis, but I really get stomach cramps. It was bad last night, hardly slept at all. I was really glad Costco was closed today because I didn't want to walk around. And uh, I even have like, like my little spandex shorts on or whatever. I need a new battery to hold my stomach in because it hurts. And I did not want to get on this treadmill. Let me stop this and get a new battery here. But I've gotten on it and I've been on it for about a half hour. While I don't feel the greatest, that kind of crampiness is kind of going away. Hang on, let me change the battery real quick. All right, let's charge this battery really quick. Let's see if I can get all of these in there. I don't think I can. I think I can. Oh, here, let's move that one. Okay, battery charge. Anyway, I knew I needed to edit today and I have extra time because we didn't go to Costco and the kids are going out to play. Kaylee's at the gym. And so I was like, you know what? I just need to get on and it does feel better. It feels better being, show my stomach, it is what it is. It feels better being kind of tucked in. I know a nap could have done the same thing, but I need to get on the treadmill. I took a day off yesterday, didn't do anything. It was Sunday, I'm trying to rest on Sundays. I will say that I've dropped another pound, even from checking this morning when I told you, when I told Jason, probably because the amount of times I'm going to the bathroom. <laughs> it's encouraging. I don't like numbers to dictate and motivate me, but right now, they are motivating me to get on this thing and to keep going. So I know a lot of you don't have one of these and have other health issues going on. I just want to encourage you to find your way of working out or walking or going for a walk with your husband or your spouse or your dog or whatever. I haven't always been like this. It's a new process for me, but I haven't always wanted to listen to other people either. Um, when my friends all talk about their runs or their marathons or their diets or whatever. I haven't wanted to listen to that and I understand. So I understand that side of it as well. 100% if you're not ready to hear it, but I'm here to motivate. If you guys need extra motivation, leave comments down below. Also, if you aren't comfortable like publicly talking about that kind of stuff, go over to my Instagram. Um, it's under Dana Creates as well. And you can send me private DMs over there. I have a lot of you that do that and I love to chat with you that way if you want it more private and you can also send me photos or whatever you want over there just know that I'm here for you guys too and you guys are definitely here keeping me going and keeping me motivated I gotta get back to this okay I'm taking a little bit of a break to tell you something I'm trying to find a song that's not copyright and that matches up, let me show you here really quick, that matches up with the entire performance for your daughter. Like this whole one and a half minute performance that I'm editing right here. I'm trying to find a song, because I can't use the song that they sing or that they dance to. I can't use that song. There's a copyright on it. So I have to find another song that's perfectly in beat. And now that I think I found one, I need to go and line it up with the beat and make sure it has enough of a vibe that I feel like the girls had in their original song. Anyway, it's hard. It's helped me a little bit because I'm listening to really upbeat music as I'm trying to find it and I'm doing my treadmill at the same time. So it's coming in handy, but I'm like, oh my gosh, can I just find a song? That's all I've been doing for like the past hour. And uh, anyway, I think Ashley's still here. Kaylee and Jacob are upstairs now. Jason and I went for a walk. Everyone's here except for Chelsea actually. Um, she's gone boating. I'll insert a few cute photos that the mom sent me.
they just went out on their boat today and one last little chance to go out with it sunny and having a day off from school uh, so that's where she's at but I gotta keep editing and add the song I think I found I think will work um, but we're coming up on five o'clock I think yeah 4 30 got about a half hour I need to make sure I have dinner done we made the ham yesterday for dinner with some potatoes and so I got to find something to go with the ham tonight I was thinking maybe like fried rice because um, I know Ashley will eat it so I just need to kind of get this done and wrapped up um, so I have some time to make dinner and then get on to regular school night because it is Monday but it is Labor Day so it's kind of like this you get a vacation day but then you need to have a reality check <sighs> and this treadmill is a reality check for me I'll just say that okay Jason's home from his run oh you're going to the bathroom <laughs> well he uh, I can't really explain why we need to do this but he wants to move a rock I'm gonna go outside for a second <sighs> just got the music timed out showed him it's good you haven't watched that video you should. Well, let's get out here. Oh, you ready? Oh, he's ready. Guess I don't get to sit out there. All right. Some for some reason he wants to move this rock. I want to move this rock and turn it into this step so that cars can pull in and out without having to worry about jacking up their front end. I know cause because it's been ten years and we haven't ever hit this rock, but that's okay. I'm gonna be pulling in here more often in the future. In the future, okay. In the future, we need to have this rock moved. I'm just gonna see how long it takes him. To move said rock, but what was that, babe? That was a challenge. Okay, it's That's four. That's a manly challenge to move a rock, pull a stump, <laughs> dig a ditch. Take it up. That's a that's a big rock to move, babe. Yep. It's a lot of manliness right there. That, this is, this, is straight up this is me conquering nature. Okay, conquer it. I'm gonna go inside. <laughs> I'm working out too. Don't even give me a hard time. What was that, babe? I hope it's not a gigantic rock. Yeah, he's like, I, mean, I, I turned the to... camera off and he's like, I hope it's not a big rock. <laughs> Do you have hooks on the front of your... I, we're not using my car to tow this out. Oh, the, no. Next time Shane's over, <laughs> he would be... That's another... He would love to pull he a rock. He would totally love to pull well, this rock out. Put, we could put the straps around it and gently just like pull it out. It would it just up. pull it out. But no, we're not doing that. He Shane doesn't... would love to do that. Well, then call him. Well, next time we have guy night. It's on the calendar. <laughs> the guy's... The other night when we had our couples night playing games, they planned a monthly guys night on Friday night so it doesn't ever impede on our Saturday night game nights. So they've already, you know, half planned a night out for just the guys. Most likely it'll just be a movie here or a movie out if we ever get good movies in the theaters again. It's been a while. Okay, it's been about a half hour. Okay. Uh, you're digging the wrong hole. No, I'm not. You well, you haven't hole? dug up the hole or uh, dug up the rock yet. What? what? What are you doing? So, this rock is okay. going to be moved and put into here. Okay. So that it, it basically you step here and then you step up on the other little step. And okay, so the yard waste bucket's going to be harder to get out if there, there's a rock in the way. I can make it flush. Okay. I'll make it flush. Okay. It'll be just like that. Okay, and then that yes. one is going to go right there? Uh, it can either go there or we can just put more big rocks to like make it so tires can roll over this without being a problem. Okay, they can roll over that too. Yeah. Okay. We'll play it out. It's got to be cosmetically landscaped. I know, per HOA. You didn't get approval for this. To dig a hole and move a rock? Uh-huh. I don't need permission. Because you're a man. I'm a man. <laughs> I asked for permission later. And then I'm saying, I moved a rock. If you got a problem with it, sue yeah. me. Okay. Well, look how, look, this isn't dirt. No, it's all rock. That's why nothing grows for us. This whole hillside is just a scree field. Yeah, because they have to make sure it doesn't landslide on us. It's fine that it's all rock because we're staying up up on top of everything because of those rocks it's not it's like it's just a big pile of okay my hand's going to sleep hey, la, la. <laughs> <laughs> he attempts to move the rock oh. you're not moving the rock I'll are you say say that all again i didn't that way 
<laughs> He's so animated that he hasn't caught on to that. I didn't have the camera rolling. What? Yeah, exactly. I didn't have the camera rolling when you were being like, oh, I'm going to get the truck. I'm going to move it. Well, you want to know now? Sure. So we put around it, we pull it up just to get it loose. Then we put the truck up there. We pull it up maybe once or twice. And then we just roll it into the hole. Okay. 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 So with Abby driving, we are headed out. We're going to go to Subway behind us. And then we're also going to go to Panda. Get some food. We should eat at home, but we just don't have... We're lazy. I was going to make an excuse, but that's the room. So, all right. We're going to go get some Subway and Panda, and then we'll go back home. Okay, now we made it over to Panda. So we're gonna grab some Panda for the rest of us. Wow, no line, nice. You like Panda? This one is home. How was your day? Tiring. But fun? Yeah. They fed you dinner too, huh? Just at their house or did they take you out? They went somewhere Okay. Did you had a good time? Since they didn't have like a, cause they need the right boat to go tubing. And right. Like too large of a boat to go super fast. Oh. So instead we did like a little mat thing. Mat thing. Uh huh. That's it fun. Was so annoying because it kept curving over on us. <laughs> and then at one point he was like, "It's too hard to get on the boat. I'll just drag you." So we stayed on it and we. Yeah. That's fun. Well, you were almost falling asleep eating your dinner. So you go guys. put jammies on. Actually, you need to go take a shower. Yeah. Okay. Nice. That'll get you nice and calm for bed. Um, okay. You like your panda? Do you love it when we get panda? <laughs> you love panda. And now you have panda for tomorrow night, too. Uh -huh. We have lots of leftover. Okay? All right. I'm going to end this video. It's probably short. Um, always on days where I'm kind of editing and stuff. Not much going on. But you did not. Did you show them your hole? I didn't show them the hole. Do you want to go see the hole? Did you get the full hole dug? The, it is dug. It is dug. I'm pretty sure it be <laughs> The rock is not in fact out. I don't care. You need a truck to pull it out. I know. I'm giving you a hard time. <laughs> anyway, uh, you're going to do that Friday with Shane? Uh, I don't know. Whenever we get together next. Okay. I thought you had it on the calendar. Ash, yeah, it's not next Friday. Oh, it's not? This coming yeah. Friday? No. Oh, okay. Anyhow, um, Ashley's got quite the little uh, system going on here. She has it organized. She's gonna do moon sand after your bath. You have plenty of time, but I want the bath first. Bath, brush your teeth, and get ready for bed, and then you can come and do moon sand. You have plenty of time, but I want that done first. Okay? The magic places in the world I've been to This is where my heart is Oh, you know it's true No matter where I go I'm coming home to you